Here he is. He's your birthday boy. It is August 7th. So that means it is Weasley's one year old birthday. It is his first birthday and I'm a crazy cat mom as we have concluded. So this is about to be a vlog. We have so many fun things planned. I'm gonna start him off by giving him his favorite little pebble food. He usually only gets this at night, but you know, it's his birthday, so he gets to get it. wanted it more than he did. <laughs> okay, I think first we're gonna go on a walk. I think that's the first thing we're gonna do. I think we're gonna go on two walks today. One now and one at night. I am ready, so now it's time to get Weasel Boy ready. Can you go on your walk? Okay, we gotta get his harness with his air tag. All right, come on, boy. Put your harness on. He hates his harness, but he loves going on walks. So he is like okay with it because he knows it means he gets to go on a walk. Show him your face, boy. Show him your beautiful birthday face. Okay, let's go. You gonna get in your stroller? Watch this. You are just the cutest. I hook him in with this so he can't get out, plus the harness. We're good to go. You ready? Let's go. Mama made me this cup, and obviously it's the one I have to use today. I would not use any other cup today besides this one. You ready, Weasel? You ready to go? Tuna thinks she's going, but she is so grumpy in the morning. If she went right now, she would be barking at all the dogs. But you can go on the one tonight, I promise. I know, we're going, we're going. Thank you so much, Casify, for sponsoring this video. Before we do anything else, I would like to take a moment and talk about today's sponsor, Casify. This case right here is by far the most complimented case I get. It is so beautiful. Like, imagine seeing someone on the phone with this case. Yeah, yeah. It's beautiful. And this is just one of Caseify's endless screen print options. But you can also get a truly customized case by being able to pick out your font and your design layout. Caseify's new Impact and Ultra Impact cases are made up of 65% recycled and plant-based materials, and all cases come in 100% recycled packaging with recycled paper and non-toxic soy ink made from soybeans. How cool is that? I mean, just look how truly beautiful this is. Created from recycled and plant-based material, Caseify's Chi Tech 2.0 technology offers drop protection up to 9.8 feet. The shock dispersing material is lined inside the case bumper, protecting all four corners. The Ultra Impact case is Caseify's slimmest, most protective iPhone case at only 13 millimeters thin. And then I take my Caseify case off to show you the wireless charging. Literally, they thought of everything. So, I mean, just a beautiful case if you ask me. Their drop protection is no no joke. I'm in my car right now, but I promise you when I drop this phone, I have no worries that Casefy has got me covered. Like, like I'm not worried at all. Like it could have hit the hardest part of my seat. Don't care. Don't care. So make sure you go to casefy.com slash Annika for 15% off your order. Again, that's casefy.com slash Annika for 15% off your order. Thank you so much Casefy for sponsoring this video. Okay guys. Guys, can we for real talk about how I just got my first sponsorship for this channel? Yeah. How was I? Was it good? Are you gonna use caseofi.com slash Annika for 15% off? You better use it? I'm so hyped about this. I'm so happy. Okay, let's go get some coffee. So I decided to not just go on a walk, but bring us to a little coffee shop and I placed it to go. I like I placed it online, so I'm just waiting for it to be ready so I can just run in and grab it. But I got Weasley some water in the meantime. I came to just love, I love just love so much. And I have to be energized for today, so I have to have a good breakfast. I got him a little side of bacon. Let's see if he wants his water. Let's put it right there. Good boy. That is a good boy. You are so, so good. He does love to play with water though. So I'm gonna have to make sure he doesn't do that. Also, I didn't mention that for his birthday, I decided that I want to donate a bunch of stuff from the Williamson County Animal Center, which is where I got him from. I'm gonna donate a bunch of stuff off their wish list. They have kitten season right now, so they have a bunch of stuff they need. They aren't open today, so maybe we'll go get the stuff today and we'll go donate it tomorrow. I'm gonna take Weasley. Put it in his name, put the donation in his name. What is it? Are you in the sun? Is that what it is? 
there we go and just like this boy literally changed my life more than literally anything so donating some things to the place that gave me him just seems like the right thing to do we're gonna go to Pe oh we're gonna go to petco he loves petco I think he's getting a little hot, so I'm gonna have to eat fast. But I got this chocolate covered strawberry drink. They had it for Valentine's Day, and I've just never stopped getting it. And then a breakfast burrito and some bacon for him. So I'm gonna give him some sausage and some bacon. Don't wipe yourself on it. It's right there. <laughs> okay, it's time to go home and open one of our presents. You wanna open a present? Oh, there's a bird. There's a bird. You having some catnip? Is that what you're doing? <laughs> Mama. Yes. You are the grandma of a one year old. I know. How does it feel? I look so good. Oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm so proud of him. He has not come that far in one year. He's still pretty reckless, but maybe by year two, he'll calm down. Has he made you a better person? He's made me a more patient. <laughs> He actually does love wearing clothes he because he loves to be cozy. <laughs> I'm just not, not good at it. It's like trying to put clothes on a moving baby doll. Or maybe just a baby. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe just a cat. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> okay, look what it says. Birthday vibe. Is that a birthday vibe boy? Your birthday was last week. Your birthday was last week. Your birthday was last week. Luna is officially six, you guys. You can have some of Weasley's cake, too. Yeah, you have a party. That's for later, though. It's a later show. This is my little container that I keep all of his stuff in. And I'll show you his present first. That's what I came to get. He loves these things, but he just gets them taken away so fast because he just plays with it and they're so loud that they're only a daytime toy. Then we have this for later. Ah! Okay. His little champion hoodie. He loves being cozy undercover so during the winter he's gonna love this. His New York one. We got the very first time we went to New York and then this is his little suitcase so when I take him to my dad's and stuff this is what I take all of his stuff in. It has WR for Weasley Rogers. If you really wanted to use your imagination, it could say Ronald Weasley, but it's from Weasley Rogers. And it has, where's that? It might be inside of it. I can't, I don't know where it's at at this specific time and moment, but it has a little like strap to make it like a, like a purse almost. So I absolutely love this. I got it from the Harry Potter store in New York. Got it customized, literally adorable. We got this little sweater for him. This used to be for one of my American boys, American Girl Doll boys, and now he wears it for some pictures. This is what he had last year, just so many clothes. So many clothes. <laughs> okay, and then I just got some a leash in here, a collar, and then the fabric for the stroller that I still have not fixed. But I'm gonna do it eventually. I just don't know when that'll, that'll be. So yeah, that's why it's all in here. And then he has another present that's staying in my car until I can give it to him because he will find it and immediately use it. Because that is exactly what happened with this toy. He found it in the wrapping and tore the wrapping off and got to it. But it's because it's a homemade catnip toy. And this catnip must be like premium catnip because him and Myrtle literally go crazy over it. He's had it for only a couple days and this is how messed up it, this guy is. I got it in Gatlinburg at this cute little like cat shop that had cats everywhere. This was one of his birthday presents but I already found it. I think I'm gonna give this to him after his first nap because I can tell he is about to pass out. 
So, Maisie's a little jealous that Myrtle's going to town on his toy. He's like, I guess I'll do this one for a ball over here. <laughs> Look at Mertzy. It's a catnip toy, I'm telling you. Did a quick little outfit change to match my claw clip. It has little cherries on it. So I'm wearing red top. It is time to go get some birthday decorations because I had clothes and a hat for Weasley, but I didn't have a hat for the rest of the animals or any celebration like decorations. So we need to go get those and I'm gonna go get a juice. And I just sat, I'll show you the birthday boy sleeping. Is your birthday snap? <sighs> He's so tired. And then I also, <laughs> set out his birthday cake to thaw. It is so cute. It's catnip, tuna, and I think just flour. And yes, it's a two-tier cake. Don't judge me. So, let's go get some decorations. It is kind of blue themed, so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this little hat, just, just in case we need it. I'm thinking these for the party hats for Luna and Myrtle, and me and Mom, obviously. Okay, yeah, I like this. I'm gonna grab these for them to eat the cake on. Oh, okay. This is everything we got. Okay, we did get the little hat. I think this would be so cute on him. He looks so good in blue. I got these plates. They're blue and green because his cake is green and I mean his cake is blue and it has some green. I mean it has some squigglies. Why can I not talk? We got the party hats. I got some of these because I think he will just love the little poppers. Someone's pulling up next to me and I just don't care. I got him some blissful catnip treats. He loves catnip treats. We know he loves balloons from my balloon arch for my birthday, so I had to get him some balloons too. I got him this toy because you know feathers are his favorite and this one like rolls away and reverses directions by itself. So it's like a self-moving toy with feathers. I mean, come on, how's I supposed to not get him? Then for me, I just got some makeup wipes. I got, I just got a color, like a landscape coloring book. It is honestly so cute. And I wanted some crayons. So I got the Colors of Kindness crayons from Crayola. And then I saw this, this is just like an impulse, pick it up. It's a cube that plugs into the wall that has other outlets on it. And under my desk, I need that because I have to unplug my Alexa to be able to plug my computer in. So that's what this is for. And that's it. So now we're gonna go get a juice and then go back home. Now that I'm breathing, I feel like I kind of talked fast in that. I think I'm just excited, but I feel like I talked really fast in that, but let's go. I'm just, I'm proving that he sleeps all day. He sleeps all day. He has not gotten up. When I showed y'all him earlier, he has not gotten off of this. He hasn't. I've been trying to do his birthday celebration all day and he's just been sleeping. So, we threw a pillow at him to wake him up and he still didn't. So I guess I'm just gonna have to set this up and then wake him up because he just said so much I don't get it. Sit it down so we can take pictures. Oh, it's so cute! <laughs> Happy birthday! Yeah. No, no, I give up. Your flashlight turns out. It's okay. Weasel tin, weasel tin, weasel tin. Okay, let's get up, birthday vibe boy. Oh, look at there! There he is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Birthday boy! <laughs> Look at that belly! <laughs> Look at his face! <laughs> be gentle with him! Okay. I hate the Get up. 
He's going through a growth spurt or something. Come look at your cake. It's a cake. He's going to take one sniff and be freaking out. Uh-huh. That's what I thought. Yeah. That is what I thought. Yeah. Birthday vibes. Birthday vibes only. Look up at me and smile, eh? Oh, no way. Get back down there with him. You'll have to screenshot this. I have to take a picture, too. Wait, where's my party hat? Yes, get your party hat on. Basically, no, go back. Put him back by the cake. <laughs> Weasley. <laughs> I can't handle it. I can't handle it. <laughs> A little behind the scenes. Oh my god, he is. This is the perfect time to take pictures because he's so tired, so you better hurry. He's Annika, you gotta hurry. He's trying to get the hat off. He got the hat off. I'll get off. <laughs> Mercy, where are you? You're missing. You better get Mercy. She's missing the party. Hold on. I have to get him first. Okay. Lay down. Okay, you ready? You ready? Stay. Stay. Bump. <laughs> One, two. Okay, we have to cut it for them. Get the plates. Okay, wait, 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 wait. There's Mercy! Mercy! Mercy came to the party! Mercy, did you come to the party? <laughs> Look at him. Oh, is he gonna eat some? He knows that it's food. Let me see if I can get a little piece off. What is it, Blakes? Are you so excited? Yeah, so he can start eating the side. That would be so cute. Oh, look at him. <laughs> Myrtle is coming to the party. We're showing her that we've got something that she will be interested in, so she needs to stick around. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Let's see that. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Weasley. Happy birthday to you. She won't get that, but. I mean, he genuinely has been eating all the crumbs. He loves it. Yeah, he likes it. You know they like smaller bites. Yeah. So maybe just crumb it up. Yeah. Oh yeah, he like, look, he's like, yes, mom. Yes. I know, still too big of a face. There you go. That's a tiny mouth. You can eat, Toons. You can eat. You can eat. <laughs> <laughs> he finally started eating a bite. And then she scared him. You scared him. Okay. Do you want presents, boy? We see your first present. Oh my goodness. Your first present is this bed. Look, boy. Oh yes, what about that? He almost went right in. What do you think, Louise? Next present is this. It looks a lot like the confetti right now, I know. But this one. So it's just strong. You're trying so hard to like it, Toons. What's next? This one. It's the roller. Oh, he sees something. Please. Please. Oh, 
my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look at it! Luna! Oh, Luna! Luna! It's his birthday cake, Luna! That is his birthday! Don't eat the whole thing just because you're trying to keep Weasley from getting it! Dang, Luna! And then Myrtle is just over there terrified! I thought that was Catherine, I'm not gonna lie, but it's just confetti. Oh, we thank you, Tina. I'm so glad we have the planes for you. That is just wonderful. What do you think, birthday boy? What do you think? Hello, everyone. It is the next day, but that does not mean Weasley's birthday celebration is over, because it's not, okay? I'm at Petco. I have a screenshot of all of the wish list items from Williamson County Animal Center. I'm gonna go in there and get as many as I can. I didn't bring him with me just because I thought that would be kind of difficult because he doesn't like sitting in the cart, but I can't push the stroller in the cart, so I just decided not to bring him with me to this spot. But after this, we're gonna go pick him up and then we're gonna take him with us to go donate all the items. So I'm about to head in and I'm really excited. I'm just so excited to do this genuinely like, ugh. My heart, they just make my heart so warm by everything they do. So, let's get a pick up. I've already gotten a couple of things. But how freaking cute is this? It's a little mushroom. That is just the cutest thing ever. So they were out of a bunch of stuff, which is sad. But I still did get a bunch of stuff that were on the highly needed list. Now I'm gonna go get Weasley, and we're gonna go take it. I'm so sad. This is all the stuff I ended up getting. There's all kinds of bags right there, and then the big cat food is at the bottom. Weasley's gonna be in here and be like, "Ooh, I got some presents," and be like, "No, no, sir, we're gonna take these to where you were born." Cause he, fun fact, he was born in the shelter, and then ten weeks later, I got him. I snagged him right up. So yeah, let's go get him. Boy secured. You ready to go? You ready to go take some stuff to the animal center? Okay, so they did just open in a new location, so we will not be going exactly to where I got him, but. It's not the same building, but the same like organization. You know what I mean? Okay, let's go. We are here. I'm so excited. Are you excited? He said we're here. We're here. Yeah, we're here. All right, we'll take. I'm gonna take it in. Probably not gonna film in there because that would kind of be awkward. But I will tell you about my experience when I get back in the car. We did it. We did it. He was such a good boy, they got our pictures. The bins were outside to donate, but I went ahead and went inside and was just like, I got Weasley from you guys. It, it was just his one year old birthday. And he, he, we, I'm flustered. I get so out of breath talking to people. Anyway, I was like, it's his one year birthday. This is what we wanted to do to celebrate. And thank you guys so much for what you do. And I donated it. It feels so nice to be able to know that a kitten like him, because he was born in the shelter, like a kitten like him is being taken care of with all those things. I got the favorite blanket that he had when he was little. I donated one of those, like just uh, warm as my heart. Also, this place is gigantic. It's the first time I've been to it and it's humongous. Like it is huge. I've seen pictures but I was like, dang. And he's like, no sir, no sir, no sir. He sees his stroller and he wants to get his stroller. Did you have fun? He's always so photogenic and he was not being good with with the pictures. Come on, boy. <laughs> he said, I just want pets. I just want pets. I just want pets. <laughs> okay. I think I'm gonna go home now. Well, that is a wrap on Weaselton's birthday. Weasel boy. He loves me, I swear. I swear. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for watching Weasel Turn One with me. And we can't wait to do it again next year. I can't imagine what I'm gonna do next year if I did all this for one, two. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.